Okay, I'm back. All right, so this is a book called A Country Mouse and a Town Mouse. It must be about two mice, one who lives in the country and the other who lives in a town. Hmm, let's open up. A Country Mouse and a Town Mouse. There we go. Huh, let's take a look at pages two and three. Here's a town mouse knocking on the door of this tree. I'm thinking this must be where the country mouse lives. Let's read to find out. Remember, it's the job of a word detective to be on the lookout for problems. A word that's tricky to read or a word that doesn't make sense or look right. As soon as you find one, stop and solve it. Will you be on the lookout as I read? Then when we find something wrong, we can stop and solve the mystery together. A town mouse went to, hmm, I need to stop at this word. That's a problem. I can't read this word. Readers, you did it. You found our first mystery to solve. All right, so now that we found the problem, we have to solve it. Are you ready to crack the case? All right. A town mouse went to, hmm. Let's get our mouth ready for that first letter. V. Could it be vacation? Not sure that would make sense. A town mouse went to v, a country mouse. Maybe there's a little word in there I know. There's the word it. Now I'm going to get my mouth ready for that v, v. Visit, a country mouse. I'm going to go back and reread to make that page sound really smooth. A town mouse went to visit a country mouse. Let's read on. Here is my house, said the country mouse. Come inside and have some food to eat. Oh, yes, thank you, said the town mouse. Let's take a look at the illustrations on the next page. Mm. Here is some corn on the cob to eat. Whoa, you're right. I need to stop there. This is the word corn, but I accidentally added more words than what's really there. So I have to stop and solve my problem. Here is some corn to eat. Not corn on the cob, even though that's what the picture shows. I need to read the words that are there. Here is some corn to eat, said the country mouse. Thank you, said the town mouse, and he ate the corn. Please come and visit me at my house, he said. Okay, that's where we're going to stop for today. You got a good start at how to be a word detective. Remember, you want to notice a problem and then stop and solve it. I want you to be word detectives in your own books today when you go and read. Good job, word detectives.